So now we come to the Niyamas, and these are said to be the, the Niyamas are your relationship to yourself. Okay, so the first one is Sauta, which is cleanliness. And again, in the Western world, we're clean. In India, they're very clean as well. They wash a lot, uh, despite it being a very dirty country. <laughs> but keeping clean physically, but also you must keep clean interiorly, internally, by eating healthy, fresh food, drinking lots of good, fresh water, taking exercise, etc. Those things all keep us internally clean. And of course yoga is wonderful because it doesn't only work on your outer body, on your muscles, it works on all your organs as well. So many of the poses are affecting your digestive system, your circulatory system, uh, and so it affects, yoga affects the whole body and makes it clean. It's a way of cleansing. Mm -hmm. So, be careful not to pollute yourself with negative influences. So, even the company that we keep, as we grow in yoga and awareness, it may be that you have to get new friends. So, you can't have your old friends because in a sense they influence you in the wrong way. So, make friends with your fellow students and create, a good teacher creates a community. A good teacher doesn't just teach classes, it, they create a community. And people become friends with each other. And that's a very important thing because if you're the only person practicing yoga and nobody in your family or around you practices yoga, you often give it up because you begin to feel you're being strange, you're being different. And so you need to mix with people who are giving you positive feedback. This is Saucha. Mm -hmm. And do you use your imagination to create positive thoughts, clean positive thoughts rather than negative thoughts? So we all have negative thoughts about others, but we also have negative thoughts about ourselves. We tell ourselves stories of what we can't do, or what we don't like to do, or what we don't like to eat even. Swami Radha said to us, you're all fussed so much about what you put in your mouth, whereas you should worry much more about what comes out of your mouth. So such a cleanliness in your speech, not using bad language. So the Yamas and the Yamas are all intertwined, really. <laughs> So that's our chunk.